Before I start this video, I would like to announce I have a Patreon page where you can get some awesome rewards, so I'd recommend checking it out. Thank you very much. Hey everybody, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing a different video, uh, which isn't normal to what I usually post, which we're going to be doing a haul video. I'm uh, not just any kind of haul video, we're actually going to be doing a Black Friday haul. And I just want to say today's Sunday when I'm recording this, so I don't know when the video is going to be out. But I'm late as frick of this and I'm so sorry but I've been working and I've been tired and I haven't done anything so that's why I haven't been able to record anything or anything. I apologize for everything. I'm trying to get into my routine again. It's just when I have these kind of things I just I, I blank out. Um, if we're gonna look out the um, mm -hmm -hmm, the uh, you know the receipt it's not it's actually very long so i use a lot of money as you can see there's a lot of stuff in here so we're gonna go through it i just want to say before anyone says something this is actually from h&m and i know a lot of people seem to hate h&m for some reason before i start i just want to make this small little rant i don't understand why people hate h&m yes it's cheap but it's actually pretty cheap and the quality is actually really good if you're a, if you're a male who's watching this video and you have shopped you probably shop at boss dress man or jack and joe's or something along that but i used to shop at uh, i used to shop at dress man because i saw the quality i thought it looked really good i will just say dress man was not expensive but it wasn't cheap either i was expecting it to be really good quality for the average price but if you look here this is actually very broken this is also very broken. The the trousers which I'm wearing right now, I'm only wearing them because they're comfortable. I'm not trying to throw shade at dress man, but really your quality sucks. Products break really easy. I have I bought three trousers from Dress Man and one of them has actually broken the pocket. So the pocket has a hole in it. So if I put anything in the pocket, it actually goes right through the hole. And I've bought from HM the recent I bought from H&M like here and there, but these trousers which I have on me, I bought them in June. The, the, the trousers started breaking one month after I bought them. So talk about quality, Dressman. Dressman, you need to really step up your game because H&M has the quality and the price. So anyone who says H&M's quality is bad clearly doesn't know what quality even is. Expensive doesn't mean that's good quality, by the way. When I bought this stuff, it was on 40% off. So everything was already cheap, but it's it was on 40% off. And yeah, so I'm gonna go through the stuff now. I've been talking too much, so yeah. Um, we're gonna start with this. This was actually one of, I don't think it was the first thing I picked, because the first thing I picked was jeans, because I really needed new jeans. I actually only have two trousers, which I actually love to use. And that's why I needed more, even though I have like th five. I don't use the three which are from Dressman because they're uncomfortable. So I bought this this hoodie, which is actually an M size, which I'm actually surprised. It was an M size and it's so freaking big. Oh my god. And it says on it, think that there's no eye, because you have to think that there's no eye. Don't worry, I will be showing you the clothes at the end. I will be doing a show off in a second. Alright, and then I bought this shirt where it says only passing through, which is so me, because I'm always passing through life. And then these were the jeans which I wanted. These were the skinny jeans which I bought, which are super duper good looking. I actually, I'm in love with these. And then I bought another jumper, which was just a plain red one, which looked like this. I don't know why I bought the big, they were so big. And they're actually an M size, which is funny. Because I'm in M. I'm M. I'm medium. And they're actually pretty big. And then I bought some skinny fit jeans. Or not jeans, but trousers. And my, my size is 30 to 32. If I have 32, um, the jeans will be tight. But they will basically be hanging a bit on the side. But if I have 31, then it's perfect. If I have 30, then it'll be a bit tight. But I could, I love tight. So this is just some plain skinny fit trousers, which are like dark blue. And then I picked a, I would say gray t-shirt because I needed something to match it with. Or I don't know. I also picked the plain white one because white always matches most stuff. I 
will say. Lastly, I picked some, I would say, normal colored jeans. I just, I, I think, I think dark jeans are actually really ugly in my opinion. So I never pick dark jeans. But yeah, I'm going to actually showcase them right now. <laughs> showcased my clothes i'm actually going to be showing what more i've actually bought so it might not be that much more than just that but i bought a lot of perfume um, i'm actually going to try them right now i did actually don't worry i actually did check them before i bought them so don't worry i bought all of them because they were the three ones which they had so i kind of needed perfumes because i don't have any and I only have I only have like sprays or something. Uh, is it just me? But do I think this one's bigger than that one? Cause it says that they're the same, but they're they don't look the same. Try this one, and these cost like roughly twenty bucks each. Oh my god, I love that. This is like a sport smell apparently. This was one they were recommending me. Yeah, this one's actually really, smells really good. I love it. And this one was something they didn't recommend me, but I just bought it anyway. I mean, this one smelled the best, I would say. They smell like, this one smells like lavender. This one smells like, I would say, nat nature. And then this is like a sports one. So yeah, that's what each one had for itself. And then I also bought this from the body shop. All of those stuff were from the body shop as well. But I bought this, um, the body shop tea tree skin cleaning facial wash, which they said that it was good for acne. And as you guys know, I get a lot of acne and it's because of why I eat, but I still want something to help it. So I have this. <laughs> it smells weird, but you're supposed to put it on morning and at uh, night. So I'm going to be doing that a bit more. This one was a bit cheaper than the others. This one cost like 10 bucks. So I'm gonna definitely put that on today. And then the final item, I didn't really buy so much on Black Friday, mainly because I don't need so much. The only thing I need is like a mirror, a new processor, a new monitor. Um, a new, like I basically need some like big stuff. And then I might need some other essential stuff, which I can get whenever. I need, like, phone case and stuff like that, which aren't really necess necessity. They're not really necessity, but I couldn't find them. Most things which I need are... Most things I need are actually something I need to buy online, so I can't really buy them in the shops. But this one, LED lights, I was actually not planning on buying these. But I bought them anyway because they seem cute, and I would love to have these on when... I'm almost going to sleep, but I want some light on. And the LED lights basically work like... I don't have a connect in here, so we put those together. Oh my god, you can actually click yes or no on these. Like, you can click if you want them on and off. So I'm going to try it. Oh, I'm